What's up guys, welcome to a new Entropy Universe video. Today I'm going to be doing a quick beginner's guide in Mindforce. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I'll get straight into it. So as a beginner player, you might realize you can't just equip this straight away. Obviously I can, because I've done the steps that I'm going to show you now. But I'll unequip it for now. Um, so the first step is go to any trade terminal. This is the closest one I have and you'll want to go into medical and buy a mind force implant and an inserter so you'll buy the inserter and then buy the implant but i'm not going to buy this because i already have one over here and then you will have this and this so you drag and drop this over the inserter then you will equip this and then you will use it after you have used it, the implant will be inserted into your body uh, and you'll be able to see it at the bottom right beside your HP bear. And you might be wondering what's the difference between um, the 20 and the 10 that's here in the trade terminal. So if you hover over the little icon on the bottom right, it'll actually tell you. So for the 20 um, version, your max profession level needs to be 20 or under. And for the 10, it needs to be 10 or under. So for beginning players, you can easily just buy this one because your skills will be very low. Um, that's about it. So once you have the implant inserted, you'll be able to equip it. Um, be able to equip this one. Oh, I need to detach this, sorry. So you'll be able to equip this and you'll see your character equipping it. You'll need some ammo. And to know what ammo you need, you can press um, view information, go into this tab, and you can see here in this line that you can either use synthetic mind essence or universal ammo. And both of those can be bought in the trade terminal, but I would suggest buying shrapnel from any trade chat and then converting that into ammo because you get 1% um, extra uh, with the conversion rate. So after you've done that, you can basically, basically go out hunting. Um, and just to tell you, there are a couple of different types of um, chips. Um, the ones I'd suggest to a beginner player is either the electric nanochip one, um, this is the two version, or the electric, or sorry, the electric or the corrosive attack nanochip one, uh, as those are best for kind of beginner players. Um, I would also suggest um, buying a an amplifier and to use an amplifier all you need to do is drag so pick it up and drop on the attack chip that you're using you can then see when you press view information uh, some stats have changed so i'll just open this as well okay so you can see the efficiency is high so it uh, hires the efficiency and it hires the damage by just two just a tiny bit so that you can then see on the chip uh, everything is orange. Everything in orange is a stat that's been changed by this um, amplifier one. So the efficiency has been increased, the impact damage has been increased a tiny bit, and therefore the uh, damage interval has also been increased. So that's about it for now. The last thing I'd like to say is just you can resell your inserter back to the TT and get the some of the ped you've spent, and it'll go straight into your account. So that's all for today. Hope you guys enjoyed and see you in the next one.